Good morning. I've got about 40 people coming to my house in a few hours for a birthday party. My husband's on a 16 hour shift today. My mom and sister are coming in a couple hours to help me get ready, but until then, I'm riding solo. My husband and I deep cleaned the house last night, but that's all that's been done so far. I have an entire taco bar to set up for 40 people. I've got all the decorations to put up. I gotta put the games outside for the adults and the kids. I have to do it all in about three and a half hours. So yeah, let's get to it. Making beef tacos and chicken tacos, so I need to get the chicken dust started in the crock pot. Why do they put the perforated edge on here if you can't even rip it open? For now, I'm just doing the chicken broth and the chicken breasts because they're frozen, and then once they dethaw a little bit, I will season them. I'm gonna start off on low, and we'll see how it goes from there. If I need to switch it to high later, I will. This house has absolutely no counter space. So I'm just gonna set up this party table to put all the food and the decorations on and just kind of work off this. I'm gonna start with decorations. Let's turn on some music. What y'all know about Mitchell Tenpenny? We're in a Kelly Clarkson mood today. This is all the food stuff. Look at these glass drink dispensers I got at Five Below for five dollars. Like that's so nice. Tell me these aren't so cute. They're traffic cones. It's an orange party cup and white electrical tape. I got to pin the bucket on the excavator. Let's do backdrop first. Oh, it smells like plastic. Maybe it's because it's plastic. What's the theme of William's party this year? Do you even have to ask for the fourth year in a row? It's of course construction. Mm, it needs to be higher, right? I feel like it needs to be higher, but at the same time, like I don't want it to go outside the edges of the fringe. Looking back at it from over there, it looks good. So I'm just gonna leave it. See, I think it looks good. I'm not too concerned that the banner is too low. This is where the taco bar is gonna be. And I got this tablecloth that looks like a road. This thing was like four bucks and it's such a thick, nice material. Like it's not a regular plastic tablecloth. I wish it was long enough for the whole bar, but I'll take what I can get, I guess. I ordered two and I was gonna put the other one outside to like lead into the house, like welcome to the party. But maybe I'll just use both of them here. So I feel like the wind would carry this away anyway if I put it outside. But also at the same time, I'm gonna have like those types of pans that you have like the little heaters under. So I wonder if this is a fire hazard. That feels like a really flammable material to me. I don't wanna put nothing here though. I don't know, I'll wait till my mom gets here and I'll ask her. These cute little signs to hang up everywhere. Food zone obviously goes in here. Dig in, that's a good one. You so excited for your party? Yes. All your friends are gonna come right, over. Yeah. Detour, good reading. Fuel station. Fuel station. That's gonna go over the drink bar right there. I don't know if I should do welcome into the party zone on the front door or oh, warning construction zone. zone. You know, I think I'll do construction zone on the back door and we'll put this one on the front door. What do you think? Good door. Sounds good? There we go. Yeah, we gotta remember to be quiet because your brother's sleeping. I don't really have the time to, but I really want to create like a curtain in this doorway out of streamers. We might do it. We might do it. Let me put the streamers in the other places. I wanted to do streamers first to make sure I have enough. Okay, we finally got it. I don't have time to do this doorway like I wanted to, but it's fine, we're gonna move on. I'm gonna go ahead and do this table and then the balloons. It's fine, because I'm gonna put you in your party clothes later, so you can wear your pajamas outside. I actually had these tablecloths left over from last year's party, so I'm reusing. There's a perk for having the same theme for the last four years. It has saved me money in decorations. This is last year's helium tank, so I'm hoping there's still enough in here.
It's starting to look really good in here. I think we are where we need to be decoration wise. So I need to get started on the food, but I think I'm going to pause and get myself ready. And then I'm going to cook the food. I'm still waiting on my mom and my sister to get here, but they should be here any minute. This is about to be the quickest anyone's ever put on makeup because I don't have time to be doing a whole lot. It is 11.15, party starts at one. My help has not arrived yet and I have not started cooking. So I'm getting a little stressed. Do my eyeliner on a hope and a prayer because I've only had coffee today, so I'm a little shaky. I've got the cornhole game already set up outside. I've got washer set up. I need to put the bounce house up. I need to put the sand toys in the sandbox. I hope my makeup doesn't look as thrown on as I'm throwing it on. It is beautiful outside. Great day for a party. We're stressed, but we're not letting it get to us because everything's going to come together and it's going to be fine. And at the end of the day, all that matters is my boy has a great fifth birthday party. It doesn't matter if the decorations aren't perfect or the food is a little late getting done, which if you know me, this is such growth because even just a year ago with my type A personality, I would have had to be like, no, everything has to be perfect. We're running late. And I would have just, I would have made the whole experience like miserable getting ready because I just had such a desire and a need for everything to be perfect, but I'm just going with the flow. I'm not worried about it. I'll take a deep breath. Okay, we're ready. I wanted to do something different with my hair, but I just don't have the time. Let's do a little fit check, a little dress, Nike Court Legacies. I feel cute, but I feel like I'm gonna be comfortable because I'm mom of the birthday boy, so I'm gonna be busy today. Let's get cooking. I think the first thing I'm gonna tackle is the guacamole, because this is a lot of freaking avocados. We gotta get the bounce house set up. Oh yeah, what's on me? Hopefully it's just water. Should've done this before I changed. My six siblings and I all went in on a bounce house because we have it for every birthday party, family get together. And then I thought, how hard can it be? Boys do it. I don't know how open it needs to be. This is the first time I've used this. Let's blow her up and see what happens. Well, what the hell? Ow, ow, ow. Are you kidding? struggle on camera, I'm sorry. <laughs> what the frick is happening? Hold on. Then over here I have washers. Where's the other one? Where is it? There it is. Washers and bags for the adults to play. Yes, hold on, watch out. Yes. because I was in such a panic because we were so behind on time, but successful party, we did it, we survived. We had a great time, I had a great time, it was a good day. Now time to get this mess cleaned up. And just like that, my house is back to normal for the most part. You'd never know there was a party here this morning. Done and done, bye.